hello students today we'll be solving a question from the chapter surface areas and volume the question says a hemispherical tank is made up of an iron sheet 1 cm thick if the inner radius is 1 meter then find the volume of the iron used to make the tank so in this question we aren't supposed to find out the volume of the hemispherical tank instead we have to calculate the volume of the iron used to make that tank and we are given with the thickness and the inner radius so let us see the solution to this question so firstly i'll be drawing a hemispherical tank and i'll be marking the radius as 1 meter remember this is the inner radius so now let us write what is given to us so we are given that the inner radius i am taking the inner radius as r1 so our r1 is 1 meters and the thickness is 1 cm the conversion is known to us that 1 cm is 0.01 meters also the unit should remain constant and therefore the thickness is converted to meters now the outer radius is equals to inner radius plus thickness so we are not given with the outer radius but instead we were given with the thickness so we can calculate the outer radius that is inner radius plus thickness so just substitute the two values which we have obtained so inner radius was 1 meters and the uh, thickness was 0.01 meter so outer radius i took it as ro so ro is 1.01 meters now volume of iron used is equals to outer volume minus inner volume so basically volume of uh, iron used is actually the uh, outer volume minus the inner volume so now we'll write the formula for both of them so it is actually 2 by 3 pi r o cube minus 2 by 3 pi r 1 cube and uh, we know the values for r o and r 1 so before substituting just see that 2 and pi are common in both of them so we can take that uh, out and the formula is modified like this so it becomes 2 by 3 pi and in brackets r o cube minus r 1 cube So now just substitute the values right r o as 1.01 and r 1 as 1 so after calculation you get the volume of iron used as 0.0634 meter cube so this is our final answer so i hope that this video was helpful to all of you thank you for watching